Good evening, everybody. Good morning. Good afternoon, wherever you're watching from. I'm so excited to have you right here with me today. I just want to share um, something I believe the Holy Ghost will have me share, especially with people that are connected to me and also believers that this video will be able to reach. I'm also going to um, ask us to do me a favor by sharing this video so that we'll be able to reach out to a greater number of believers and um, it's going to do us a lot of good. Um, the essence of sharing these is so that we can take some steps as believers and we can uh, come into the accurate understanding of what God is doing. Now, it's very important for us to understand that as believers, we are not only to know what God is doing, but we must also be sensitive to know what Satan is doing so that before he launches his attack, we'll be able to put in the right structures in place so that we will not be victim of whatever he's doing the bible says that um, we are not ignorant of his devices it's a less certain takes advantage of us so i'm just going to be sharing this based on a personal revelation that i heard and um that i heard and also um i believe it should also it will also help us to be able to put in the right um, um, the right structure and to make the right move to stop whatever Satan is trying to do. James chapter 4 verse 7, he said we should submit ourselves on the God um, and they said we should, we should resist the devil and he will flee. Uh, we are not ignorant of his devices and um, the Bible also made us understand that as believers we are to watch and pray which means we are to be sensitive just to his move to be able to know how to attack and how to defend our faith now there is something i believe satan or i i caught in revelation that satan is planning to execute trying to stop or trying to um attack the move of god that is coming and i see this happening very and it's coming very strong from these so-called the lgbtq community i see a massive invasion um, um, um i see this community sponsoring a major move and i discover that they were going to be making use of celebrities those in entertainment art and cultures in the nollywood movie they are going to be sponsoring and they are going to be driving this demonic agenda all in the name um, and the strategy is to start painting pictures, to start um, showcasing videos of men who can comfortably dress as ladies or ladies dressing as men, just to be able to project this video and then um, people begin to follow that pattern and then lesbianism, gay and all these things will now get to a point that it will be so rampant in our days as believers we are to be very sensitive when these uh, when these begin to happen and we have to start putting in the right structures and we have to start putting the right principles in order not to allow for whatever satan is planning to do so 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 uh, so so the revelation is such that um, this community um is going to massively sponsor they're going to put in so much of resources in in dollars in millions are going to put so much of resources into this particular um, um mountain called the media the entertainment and in the culture where they will sponsor men to dress especially in the fashion world to dress like women and then they will project them in videos in music online on our tv channels and um, and you see some believers or people when they keep feeding their eyes with some of this video then they there be an impartation in their spirit and unconsciously some of them will begin to dress after that manner so there are many things here it does not mean it does not mean but it is a trap of the devil to invade uh, to invade the people to in, to attack um, whatever god is trying to do but our believers i believe that we need to start praying not just prayer we also need to put in the right structures by teaching people and also by guiding against some of these antichrist culture some of these unbiblical unbiblical culture so why i'm sharing this video is so that we all as believers at um, in our 
various organizations, I mean churches or as individuals or as a family, we can begin to um, build the altar of prayer against this move. And also we can also educate one another against whatever oppression Satan is trying to channel into the body of Christ, especially through this community i've seen while i've seen i've, I've seen i've seen believers and uh, men dressed like women i've seen i've seen certain 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 dispositions from believers and accommodating some of these um unscriptural unscriptural culture um that are not that and um, that i believe we must fight against satan will do everything to attack the move of god satan will do everything to divide the body of christ satan will do everything to corrupt the operations of god but as believers we have to watch we have to be sensitive and we are to pray this is what i just want to share with us and i believe that i believe that god is also raising remnants that will be able to stand and fight against the operations of of the devil so please i would like us to i would like us to share this video to um it's not a long video i'd like us to share this video to other believers and we can also build systems of prayer around this video and to come against the activities of the devil remember in the book of Acts chapter 12 when Herod came to attack the church, the first person he picked was James. The church didn't pray for James, but, G but James died. Why? Because of the prayerlessness, of the insensitivity of the church. But when the Bible says, when, Ju um, when Herod saw that killing James pleased the Jew, he proceeded further to unpick the man called Peter. But the church rose and they began to raise prayers. I believe that the church by now or at in this season, we need to intensify in our prayer. We need to intensify in our prayer against the move, against the operations of the darkness in our days. The Bible says, as water covers the sea, the, earth, the, the sea so shall the knowledge of God cover the earth so we, we, we as we begin to en enforce um as we begin to uh, leverage on prayer as we begin to pray as we give ourselves to much prayers i believe prayer is a very powerful weapon in this particular season and we can also put the right structure in place to be able to contend against the oppression of darkness so i just want to share this few um thought with us and uh, i also want us to pray together and also keep praying and um, I know that um, God is about to do something great, something massive in our days. Father, we thank you. We give you all the glory. We magnify and we exalt your name. You said in your word that we should resist the devil and will flee. So we come tonight together in the name of Jesus, in the unity of faith, and we resist every move of the devil, every activity of the devil, every operation of the devil in the name of Jesus. In the book of Job chapter 5 verse 12, the Bible says it disappointed the devices of the crafty that their hands couldn't perform their enterprise. What Whatever plan, whatever strategy, whatever scheme that Satan is planning to execute in this season against the body of Christ, Father, we come against those moves in the name of Jesus. Father, we declare that you will help us in this season to be sensitive to whatever he's doing and also to be able to yield to your instructions in the name of Jesus. I commend you to God and to the word of his grace, which is able to build you up and to give you an inheritance amongst them which are sanctified in the name of Jesus. So kindly please share these videos um, and let other people also be part of this video. And you can also make comments um, at the comment section and I know that God is going to bless you. Thank you so much. Have a wonderful time.